Copy. Disengaging. Initiating auxiliary thrusters. Command, we are 20 seconds to atmosphere breach. Initiate burn. Rotate on break. Primary ignition set to 30%. Rotating. We are engine first. Altitude 20,000 feet and falling. Hold on. We are getting interference. Switch to a high gain antenna. Command, confirm signal strength. You're looking great, Boudouin. Go for landing. Engines off. Pod 1 has landed. Almost looks like home. That's what worries me. Well, boss, you're ready. Got my truck. Snipers at three and six, multiple defense lines, and an operating base established within the hour. Move! Goodman, a word. You know the stakes of this mission. Flores is already half dismantled. Our engine's on its way down to power a city of half a million. Now, if these outrider bozos hit pay dirt, you report to me first. Sir, I'm only here to answer a proper procedure this fall. We're not on Earth, Shearer. There is no proper procedure. Listen up, outriders. I know what you're all thinking. There's no going home. And no one has a clue what's waiting for us out there. But the ECA pencil heads can't greenlight this land until we find their missing probes. So let's do our job! Move out. Stay sharp. Watch our sixes. <sighs> Would you smell that air? I can't even process breathing air that doesn't smell like a burnt carburetor. I didn't mind the air back on Earth. I was used to it. <laughs> Trust me, you'll get used to fresh air too. Truth is. None of us should have even gotten off Earth. Survivor's guilt. You think any one of us isn't feeling it? It's not just that. If the Caraval's engine hadn't exploded back on Earth and killed most of the real Outriders with it, there wouldn't be a bunch of mercenaries down here in their place. I hired you because you don't let anything get in your way.
make camp here. Outrider, set a beacon flag. Let HQ know the area is secure. All right, people, we got jobs to do. Cuthbert, Scarstead, set up a perimeter. I want fortifications going up within the hour. Jakob, you're field testing the munitions. Gutman, get your scanner up and running so we can find those damn probes. Outrider, a word. Hey. No matter what happens out here, I need my best gun on this in case things go south. Can I depend on you? Just tell me what to do, Cap. My weapons haven't been fired in nearly a century. Why don't you head over to Jakob and get your gear checked, and then be prepared to move out as soon as those probes are located. Any questions? No word from Earth, I assume? It's really gone. She went dark 15 years into our journey. More or less as predicted. ACA's confirmed no communication since. <laughs> Shit. You know, I uh, grew up a slum dog, fighting for scraps. Lost everyone, really, long before the end. Doomsday just wasn't a thing I worried about. Hell, it was never gonna live past 20 anyway. Somehow, <laughs> I was one of the ones who made it. Don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing here. As things go right, time's coming, you're gonna have to leave all that behind. This is a new beginning. You could have a family here. Build a cabin. Grow old and get fat. That's not me, Jack. Know my way around bullets, not kids. Gonna be no need for someone like me here. Maybe the old you, Outrider. But you're one of the chosen few. You get to build the future. Don't waste it. Did any more of your people make it off Earth, Cap? My brother. Almost. But no. They got him in cryo as we evacuated L.A., hoping we could stop the bleeding. Ah, uh, he was too far gone. Ah, shit. Sorry to hear that. I haven't had the time to think about it. What about Sarah? She's good, right? Yeah. My Sarah's up there. They don't wake her group for another six months, but I can wait. I'm, uh... I didn't have a chance to tell you this in all the madness, but my little girl's pregnant. That's how I got her the seat. <laughs> Two for one special, huh? So that's why I've been in such a good mood since they unfroze your ass. Don't push it outright. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir, granddad, sir. I'll go find Jakob's shooting range. Good. We're on standby for those probes, so stay on alert. What's on your mind, boss? I know that look you get.
What do you make of this place, Jacob? It's perfect. Beautiful. How long you want to bet before we bury it all under concrete and plastic? Oh, come on. You can't still be that cynical. Just look at this valley. I don't know, boss. Maybe we all just got too much riding on this. We already have one dead planet in the rear view. If we screw this one up too, it... Maybe we won't. Sure, maybe this is really it. Maybe we can finally stop sleeping with our guns under our pillows, stop worrying about food every goddamn day. Believe me, boss. I want this to work. You have no idea. But, well, people don't change. Still got your money on black, huh? The house always wins. Time to test my gear. Uh, up for some target practice, boss. Let's get started. Ooh, fancy stuff. Yeah, a new toy. You're the first one to test it out, boss. Think you could take on a tank? Somehow, 80 years has improved. Now give that sidearm a try, eh? Hey, you're Shira, right? Oh, I'm sorry. Can you believe this landscape? It's so beautiful. Oh, if only we had an internet to post those to. It's from a scientific record. Besides, we'll have the internet up and running in the first six months. The entire thing is backed up. I'm just pulling your leg, Shira. Any luck with the probe? The scan's still running. I don't know what else I can do, it's just... How can the probe's signals have simply vanished? Yeah, they said it was some kind of interference or something. Ah, from space, maybe, but not from down here. Still, seems the initial readings were right, the breathing. Yes, but before the ECA can authorize half a million more people coming here, we need the probe's data to know we can support them. And if we can't? What's the ECA's plan B? Do you have any questions I got answers to? How's this colonization gonna work? You're in the planning rooms, right? Yes. We've already started disassembling the engine. We need to bring that down first. The nuclear core should give us enough power to get the colony up and running. And when do the civilian pods start coming down? Within a few weeks, if all goes well. First, just enough people and resources to get our infrastructure running. You know, water, food, and shelter. Then we'll keep waking folks from cryo, a few thousand at a time, no more than we can feed. Until before you know it, you'll be standing in the middle of a city. 
Meanwhile, the Flores stays up there? The ship was built in orbit. It was never meant to land. We'll have to keep it in our skies until we're capable of space flight again. One day, maybe. Hey, is that supposed to blink that way? Oh, 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 oh. That's a probe. Tanner, I think we got a signal. It's close. Excellent work, Outrider. Now go locate the damn thing so we can land this beauty. Copy that. Hey, it's an historic moment. We should document it. For the scientific record, huh? Cow things is sunning itself right on my path. Hey, maybe you can get close enough to get a DNA sample. Not exactly our priority, but if I can get close without spooking it, I'll try. Nah, scared it off, but I've secured the objective. Fantastic. Got some kind of storm brewing. Cap, found the probe. Looks like it landed pretty hard, but the data seems intact. Copy that. Transmitting to HQ now. Good work, Outrider. Hold on. Tanner? I'm picking up a second signal, but something's weird about this one. Weird? The bitch is rising and falling? It's supposed to be a steady tone. Outrider Alpha to HQ. Hold off on calling in that green light. We got another probe out here to analyze. Negative, Alpha. Your job is done. Damn it. Maxwell, listen to me. We can't afford to make mistakes. Give us time. Any more time and we lose our orbital window. We have the data. I'm calling it in. You want to keep searching? Don't blame me if you find trouble. Over and out. <sighs> All right, Outriders. Rendezvous back with the convoy. Let's go find that stray. Hey, Cuthbert, any updates? The probe signal is mostly noise, but I've tracked its source. There. Hope you all brought your galoshes. Ooh. Jacob, mm. same shit, different planet. Ochevishcha. <laughs> HQ, 
We've encountered a potential biological hazard. Requesting quarantine procedure at base. Damn it, Tanner! I told you Bozo not to go mess up this operation! It's my name on the line! Hey boss, we lost you. I'm getting our straight probe. How's Scarstead? He looks like shit. Any idea what this black gunk is? Some kind of saprophyte or mycelium? But this collects samples. Got attacked by one of those cow things. Something drove it crazy. I had to put it down. Keep an eye out. Copy that, Outrider. I found it. Good work. Get the drive, so get the hell out. Wait, hold on. This thing's just in relay mode. Tanner, the signal isn't coming from the probe. It's coming from outside our search zone, somewhere else on the planet. That's impossible. There is nobody else. Secure the hard drive. We'll analyze that signal back at base. Copy. Oh, damn it! Something's frying it, Tanner. Give us the frequency. Uh, carrier frequency is nine seven point. Tanner, do you copy? Tanner, Tanner. I'm seeing some really strange shit down here. The fuck? Oh boy! Get the hell out of this 
Got heavy casualties. Possible contamination. I need quarantine set up at base. Do you copy? <laughs> Shit. Maxwell, what the fuck is all this? What does it look like? Sergeant Major, sir, we have to follow quarantine procedure and hold the landing. Whatever the original reports about this planet, they were wrong. There's some kind of anomaly. If we land now, everyone will die. There's no holding the landing. It's too late for that. There's nowhere else to go. <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> <laughs> Tanner here! We need help! <laughs> we need medics! See to them! Hurry! No, stop! They're contaminated. We contain them. That's an order. You always were an asshole. Look around you! We got men and women in need of medical attention! Now get your asses in gear and do the right thing, or I'm gonna have to- No! Contain this. Now. Burn the fucking bodies. Maxwell set up a blockade. He's gonna burn everything down. Why? So he can tell the story his way. How the Outriders fucked everything up. He needs to die. I'm wrong, wait. Maxwell, he's the only one who can call off the landing. You need to get into two regions. Maxwell, the building! Wait, wait, wait. Come 
almost there. They're gonna be fine. What are you doing? I'm putting you back into cryo until Medlab can save your fucking life. Don't be ridiculous. I'm done for. Pep talks aren't really my thing. When is something truly over? Was it when your people left Earth behind? Was it when you watched the first spaceship crash and burn? Was it when you saw your fellow Outriders crumble at your feet? Was it watching yourself die? But Enoch isn't done with you yet, Outrider. Like I always say, it ain't over till it's over. Just leave them here. These are outriders. They're not why we're here. I'm sorry. Exiles while your ECA pals got fat in their bunker. 
Bullshit! It wasn't like that! We lost electronics! We could have left you all to rot in your cryopods! But we did! We saved you ungrateful! How many times did I tell you to shut up? <laughs> Welcome to the Valley of Death, asshole!
here. Get across this hellhole. Whatever the fuck's happening? I don't belong on this side. What in the? Oh shit! to this.
smell the storm in your blood. Your stink of Enoch. Your kind are abominations. Exile. Who the hell are you? Outrider. Impossible. Such untapped power. Such confusion. You want answers. Whatever you were before, you're something new now. A second life. Don't waste it. Who... Who was that? Lord Zeth? He's... He's altered. And he's a little man. A little man. Altered? What the fuck does that mean? You... <laughs> you don't know what you are. <laughs> Where'd you steal that uniform? Didn't. It's mine. Yeah? If he's really an outrider, then you fight's on the wrong side. Haltered. What are you talking about? Yeah, yeah. Uh, the Grand Marshal, she'll explain. Come. Where is she? There. There. What is that? Go, go, go. Yeah. Do whatever you have to do, Lieutenant. Shira? You're alive. I'm sorry to disappoint you. You came from their side. You got any intel for us? Are you fucking kidding me? Look, I got a war to win, so either you help me, or you get back into cryo. Hold on! I've just woken up to mud and shit, I've been asleep for God knows how many years- 31 years! So for 31 years, I've been seeing people fight and die while you were getting comfy in cryo. So excuse me for not throwing you a little welcome party. What happened to you? The anomaly! That's what happened. You mean that storm? We told them not to land. Anything more advanced than a grease engine got fried. All our data wiped out. We couldn't grow crops or make medicine. So we ended up in the same place as when we left Earth. Just killing each other over the little we have left. Why didn't you go somewhere else? The Outriders could've- The Outriders are dead. What? And the anomaly keeps us in this fucking valley. We can't go anywhere else. You don't get it, do you? You think you're dreaming? This is real. Believe me, it's fucking real. So whether you like it or not, you're stuck here in the mud and shit like the rest of us. You should have never woken up. What? And miss out on all this? Grand Marshal, we were too late. The hounds have him. He's been taken underground. Well, get him back. Well, it may be our side, but that's not our turf, ma'am. I'm not losing people over Jakob. Jakob? He's still alive? Not too much longer, it seems. Then I'll go find him. Ma'am? Ma'am? Never mind. I've got it covered. So Jakob's in trouble and I need to go save his ass. At least some things never change.
Hey, Shira. I'm geared up and tracking down Jakob. Now, who the hell are these assholes? They're thugs, drug runners, and child slavers. They call themselves the Hounds. And believe me, no one's gonna miss them if you put a few guns in good body bags. Why the hell haven't you done something about them already? Honestly? Because they're black market and keeps our soldiers happy. And at least they're not eating their own fucking kids like the insurgents were fighting out there. Yeah, I met a few of them. Not so friendly. What you see is what you get. Shit, if I had those kind of powers, I wouldn't just be out there fighting on an alternate set. One. It ain't fair. Move along, nothing to see here. So what did the old guy do? Pissed off. No. Guys close to the Grand Marshal too, no. which is why the boss promised us double the pay. Still gonna be a big risk. Mercy. Need to get it over with. We'll rough him up just a little bit more and then we'll try. You've come to the wrong place! Jakob Dabrowski. Go away. Listen, asshole. You got a gun pointed right at your...
Now where's Yakum? Nice eyes. Hey! Whoa. Whoa, sorry guys. I thought this was the bathroom. You okay? I had it under control. Been a while. Do I know you? Kurva! Then I thought you were dead. You'll soon be dead if you don't get your ass to Shears right now. Uh, Shear up. All right. Come meet me there when you're ready. Shira, I got Yak about in one piece. He's on his way to you. That old drunk just refuses to die. <laughs> Well, you should come join us. We have some catching up to do. No, because he won't. Because he can do what the fuck he wants. Hey, never been so happy to see a familiar face. You haven't aged a day. You got old, my friend. In the hallway, that was Seth. What was he doing here? Ignoring our pleas for help. I thought it was on your side. <laughs> Seth, he's not on anyone's side. The insurgents have altered their walking nightmares. We're lucky Seth shows up to fight them back sometimes, but only if it fits whatever the hell game he's playing. Hey, damn it. You have no idea how bad it is, Outrider. We thought we escaped the apocalypse. We thought we could start over again here. But we were wrong. I was wrong. Shira. Do you know why I'm in charge? Because I'm the only officer left alive. The insurgents at our door, they're feral, sadistic, they have us surrounded. We're low on food and bullets. And if those freaks don't kill us, this planet will! Welcome back. The black fungus in the forest. We never found a cure. The mountains are filled with abominations. And the anomaly storms get bigger every year. We don't have much time left. If we don't find a way out of this valley, if we don't find a miracle, this last shred of humanity is over. Shira. Oh, would you look at that? I can do things now. I don't understand, but maybe there's a reason. Yes, you are. I guess I know why I saved your damn life all those years ago. I'm sure this isn't exactly what you had in mind. I'm not complaining. 
Still, I don't get in. The day we landed, that storm, it tore Cuthbert apart, but not me. Why? Why was I- Altered? Who the hell knows? When those storms hit, some get ripped inside out, some turn pink polka dot, and a few come back. Fucking immortal. Nothing about the anomaly makes sense. It disrupts the laws of nature. It mutates whatever it touches. Early on, the ECA's best scientists tried to understand the storms, to tame them. None survived. I guess you got lucky, boss. <laughs> or maybe not. All I care about is that you are on our side. Our only supply line is blocked by an altar that our weapons cannot touch. Out by the old solar array. Seth had no interest in helping us, but now, you're here. Hell, why not? Maybe I can buy humanity another day. Lieutenant, what the hell was that? The whole front line just collapsed! Like an earthquake, all right? I, I, I think we lost our whole first line of defenses! On my way. Go, go, go! Hey, in case I don't get another chance, I, I tried to find you, but it all went to shit. We had to run for our lives. I just... Forget it. I'm alive. We should have been dead ten times over, if not for Tanner, if not for Shira. I'm the one with dues to pay now, Yakum. Boss, I missed you. It's good to have you back. Now go beat that altar's ass for us. So we can get back in this goddamn fight. <laughs> <laughs>